Oh boy, oh boy. All right, we're gonna get this done as quick as possible. All right, let's go to the shop. Let's go. I went the wrong way. Alright, let's do it. Let's do like a ton. We have so many coins, man. Let's just keep it at a 50-50. We'll go until... Oh. Scissors. We'll go, like, we'll go until it literally is just a 50-50 every time. Which I think seems to be four at a time. Oh no, it's, it's a little more than that. Okay, it's still going up. God damn. Damn. We already have these, dude. All right, let me let me get up the um the list of things. The list of uh, of things that people like. God damn, we're gonna run out super quickly at this point. Right. Who should we hang out with today? More salt. Jesus Christ, this is going super fast. Like, we didn't even get that many things. It's fine, it doesn't matter. We got a sword. God, we're getting so many duplicates, dude. This sucks. This sucks. <laughs> oh, that's new. Cat hairpin? Cute. Well, that's all we can do. Let's hang out with, uh... Hmm. today. Let's, look at, let's hang out with Hero. I guess. Someone doesn't want to. <laughs> Alright, where is he? I guess it's not gonna show where they are. Are you serious? Oh no, it does. Okay. All right. Well, let's. Uh, yeah, I suppose we'll hang out with them. Um, with Hero. If we can hang out with Kyoko, I'd like to, but I don't think she's gonna want to. So. Yo. You need something? Do you need something, Makoto? <laughs> Better not be my life. Don't kill me. <laughs> Help me. After life, protect me, Moto. If you kill someone, kill someone. If you must, but don't kill me. Hmm. Should I spend with Hero while she's acting like while he's acting like this? Spend some time with Hero. Well, well then, why don't we have a heated? <laughs> he's just fine with it now. Why don't we have a heated discussion about Cosmo Cos Cosmogony? I learned all about Hero's theories about the origin of the origin of the universe. Hero and I grew a little closer today. Should I give Hero a present? Yeah. Do we have any of those uh, golden rockets? <laughs> Let's give him this. We do. Golden airplane. Sorry. Golden airplane. My 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 apologies. Huh? You're saying I can have this? All of a sudden, I feel invigorated. I feel awake. I feel like I like you. Seeing you so pleased with something I gave him makes me so happy. Yo. 
Hey Makoto, what's up my brother and fellow mother lover? Let's raise our semi-siblings upright, okay? Stop talking about that. Oh, so, so you ready for the next round? Never! Actually, how do you do your fortune telling anyway? I saw you doing palm readings and stuff, and you didn't use any tools or anything. Hmm. Wow, I didn't know you knew, you knew about divination tools. Sounds like you know your way around the spirit world. Well, I'm not sure you need to know so much about those kind of tools. Yo. Now that I know you're an expert, I have a question for you. Correct answer gets you another discount. No thanks. Could it be? There are 22 cards in the ma known as the Major Arcana, and 56 cards known as the Minor Arcana. Generally, the cards in the Major Arcana are used for divination. Do you know what I'm talking about? Major and Minor Arcana. Arcana. The Major Arcana cards are used to tell the future. That must be... Tarot. I, I like doing tarot readings. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. You're talking about tarot cards. What? What? Ah, gloriously correct. I will now tell your, <laughs> your fortune for nearly 600 bones. Wow, really? Something I'd never say. I've only had an, enough fortune telling for one lifetime. Mm. I see. Well, if you ever change your mind, you know where to find me. Sure thing. Anyway, getting back to what I asked you about before. If you don't use any tools or whatever, how do you do your fortune don't telling? Don't be mean. Well, don't be fooled. I have my own techniques. For example, I apply num numerology. Numerology? Ugh. God, excuse Yo. me. It uses a mathematical form formula to predict the future based on birthdays, letter numbering, and all that. But I don't see you doing anything like that either. Hmm. Well, it's more of an inspirational style of fortune telling. Some kind of unknown power just acts through you, and suddenly, bam, you got the info. You're talking about intuition. How about that? Don't try and describe it, describe it using such a cheesy word. That is not, if that's not intuition, but it's got to be some kind of supernatural power. It's not like some don't compare my clairvoyance to some occult bull crap. I hate the occult. Take that crap somewhere else. You hate the occult? Well? Yup. Now here's some good news. Act now, and I'll throw in some extra bonus... Extra bonus on your reading. I use white magic to record a CD of spirit messages I received from the luxury suite of heaven. Five seconds of this baby and you'll be witnessing mir miracles and communing with angels for days. And you said you hate the occult? What the heck? Hey, business is business. The more I talk to him, the less I understand. That was, uh, I don't like, ugh, I don't like talking to Hero. <laughs> I shook off Hero's sales pitch and headed back to my room for a while. More every day? I have plenty of time. I don't feel like just sitting here. I should go somewhere. All right, more free time. Let's do it. Man, everyone's around here. Let's, uh... Can we hang out with, can, can we hang out with Kyoko? Where was she? Hold on. She was in the laundry room, right? Is she, is she gonna wanna hang out with me? <laughs> Probably not, huh? Where is she? Is that not where she was? Am I an idiot? Oh, she's in the dressing room. Whoops! I have big W. That could be or beat him in the lawn. Cool. So, like I said earlier, I'm kind of burnt out today. Uh, you weren't here for it. I'm probably gonna, uh... I'm probably going to uh, not finish the whole chapter today. I'm kind of tired and like I kind of just want to uh, stop soon. Plus, I'm like, like, I know this, I know this is kind of a dumb, uh, a dumb reason. But honestly, I'm a little bit discouraged <laughs> because of the fact that I was spoiled. Uh, but it's fine. It's OK. Uh, I'm not really worried about it. I'm um, yeah. So I'm probably just going to go until like the big event happens um, after this chapter, like the um, like the death, quote unquote, if it even happens this time, and then I'll stop. I'm not going to do like the investigation or the class trial. Go away. She won't even look at me. I guess she doesn't even want to see my face. God damn. Stream daily life for one stream, deadly life for another. See, I might do that. I'm probably just going to do that this time, just because of the fact that I, uh, I'm kind of burnt out. I'm. Half burnt out because of the fact that I'm tired, and half burnt out because of the fact that I, uh, got spoiled. <laughs> I'm a little bit upset about that, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I mean, I know it's for the second game, but, like, I don't know. Okay, fine, you know what, I'll fucking do it. I'll hang out with Toko. Oh, it's Suicide Jill. I'm much more happy about that. It's okay. It's it, it's not a big deal. 
What's up? You want to go to a murder spree with me? Is it really a good idea to hang out with Genocide Jack? Yeah. You want me to kill you or something? You're not even close to getting me heated up. The time I spent with the murderous fiend was almost valuable. Did I just get a little closer to Genocide Jack? It's alright. It's I know it was a slip up. I'm not blaming you. I just... I don't know. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Don't, don't let it be anything. I'm all, it's probably just because I'm like, I'm super burnt out today, dude. I got horrible sleep last night. I'm just like not really in the mood to stream today, but I don't want to not stream Danganronpa on Friday, you know what I mean? So I'll probably just go until like, you know, whenever. Probably like two hours in is when I expect it to happen, and then after the invest when when the investigation starts, I'll, I'll close it out. Yeah, I probably will take a good nap. I stayed up until like four in the morning last night. I was stupid staying up until four in the morning last night. And like, yeah, I got like six hours of sleep. I know that's, I know that's like, still a bit, but like, my sleep schedule is really shitty, and I really need to like, sleep and take a nap. Did I just get a little closer to Genocide Jack? Would you like to give Genocide Jack a present? I'm actually really glad that it's Genocide Jack and Otoko. I love Genocide Jack. She's, she's like one of my favorite characters. Um, let's give her. She likes the um, the everlasting bracelet. If we have one of those, yeah, this one. Let's give it to her. Oh, we don't have any. Uh, we have the, um, hold on. <laughs> Dang. I was really hoping she'd like the, uh, the thong. There was a small little bit of me that wanted, that wanted, wanted to give her the thong. Let's give her this. We have three of them. Wait, I'll find out. What do you, we'll find out what? You're giving this to me for really real? Yes. Oh man, I'm getting excited like whoa here. Oh yeah, that's right. Seeing Genocide Jack so pleased with someone I gave her so it makes me so happy. I guess. <laughs> I like Genocide Jack, dude. Oh what? She didn't give me any like valuable things. Weird. Okay, that's okay. I like I like hanging out with Genocide Jack. It's fun. Attention! Attention! Oh. Shit, this is new. I gave her a handbag. This is new. Please gather in the gym as <gasps> soon as you possibly can. Oh no. Quickly, 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 quickly. Uh oh. Uh oh. He made a special announcement to ask us to come to the gym. And he sounded pretty serious about it too. Uh oh. Oh, emotive, you're right. Oh no. Sakura. Me too. I forgot about this time too. Hey, Sakura, what's up? Oops. Poor Sakura, she just wants to sleep. Huh. You're the last one. Everyone else is already inside. Aren't you gonna go in? However, I have a bad feeling about this. More than just a feeling, probably. Oh, that's not her. More than just a feeling, probably. Monokuma did call us all together, after all. Sakura? Well then. Makoto. If something happens to me, Hina. Huh? I'm sorry. No, never mind. So then. I, I'm... Who would ever believe in... Who would ever believe in someone who doesn't believe in themselves? Um... Sakura? <laughs> okay, Sakura. Mm, I love Sakura. She's my favorite. Everyone must have heard the announcement. That once we were all gathered in the gym, it began. Oh my god, I'm so... gassy. It's <laughs> gross. Oh shit! Here we go! What's up, Manakuma? Well? Okay, let's get this show on the road! You're about to give us the next motive presentation, aren't you? Mm hmm? Mm hmm. That's right. You got us all together to present another motive, right? Is he right? Huh? We have to go through this again? <laughs> No, not again. I can't take it anymore. I see. I'm impressed by your level of dismay. You finally see just how low on the totem pole of life you really are. No, yeah. no, 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 no. <laughs> That's not it at all. Oh, shit. We're not here to talk about the motive. Today, the reason I gathered all here today is so I could get rid of my grudge. Your grudge? Why? We have a grudge against you, of course, but I don't recall you ever having a grudge against us. Hmm. I told you yesterday, I did, yesterday, <laughs> he's Australian now. I told you yesterday, didn't I? An eye for an eye, a fang for a fang. Stop beating around the bush, just tell us what you're talking about. 
Well, Biakia, you've already told everyone knows how one of us... How, we, you already told everyone how one of you might be working as a spy for me, right? Come on. Yeah, so what about it? In other words... Well, today I'd like to tell you about that spy. What? Hey. So guess what? <laughs> oh, shit. The spy is actually Sakura Gummy. He said it so openly. It made it sound like it wasn't a big a deal. Even though he just revealed a huge secret. What? What? What did you just say? He said the spy is Sakura. What? What are you talking about? There's no way Sakura's a spy. Um, right, Sakura? Huh? Sakura? Huh? <laughs> and I might just make Sakura fulfill the promise she made sometime soon. And if she doesn't, I can't be responsible for what happened to that hostage of mine. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. What you guys choose to do with that information is up to you. Roast her, boiler, drills. kill her, don't kill her, whatever. I can't wait! I can't wait! And just like that, he was gone. Finally, he understood. We, I understood what he had been talking about. An eye for an eye, a fang for a fang. In other words, betrayal would be met with betrayal. Oh shit, so Sakura betrayed him? Uh, um, what so what does this mean? What? Is it true? Has Ogre really been spying on us with a mastermind? What are you saying? What are you saying? There's no way! <laughs> but that is what the stuffed animal said, right? Wrong. You're wrong! He's wrong! There's just no way! Well, Sakura, if he's wrong, all you have to do is tell us. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't tell you earlier. Huh? What? Oh, he was being no! serious for serious? Ogre's been working for the mastermind? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah! So you've been lying to us all this time? Huh? It's not true. Sucker was probably being controlled. There's gotta be some some reason. She didn't have a choice. She was just forced to do it. Yeah, I'm sure Hina's right. The mastermind probably threatened her somehow, and Sakura had no choice to do what she was told. Yeah! What? You're talking like you don't know like you know that for a fact. Because I do know for a fact. Because I saw it. I saw Sakura and Monokuma fighting. And that's where I heard it. Monokuma mentioned a hostage a second ago, right? And during their fight, I heard Sakura say she decided to fight against the Mastermind. I see. You saw that? The Mastermind took you took a hostage, and you were forced to swear loyalty to them, right? But in the end, you made up your mind to betray the Mastermind. What? Which means Sakura isn't our enemy. She's a friend who we can trust without question. Is that it? Hmm. Ridiculous. You live in some sort of alternate reality fairy tale. Not possible. She was the mastermind's tool. You absolutely cannot trust somebody like that. Impossible. He's right. We can't just believe whatever she says now. How can we even sure she really did betray the mastermind? Maybe this is a double bluff and she's doing exactly what the mastermind wants. What are you saying? Sakura would never do that. <laughs> okay then, Sakura. If you really have cut ties with the mastermind, tell us who you really are. Well... I'm sorry. Sorry. I can't... Even I don't know that. What? You don't know? Well, that just makes me even more suspicious. But please! She's telling the truth. You have to believe her. Don't make me repeat Shut up. Myself. I'm not finished questioning Come her. On. Next question. What's this about a promise? What did the mastermind order you to do? I was told to kill one of my friends. It suddenly felt like the temperature in the room had dropped 20 degrees. The weight of those words. I see. I see. So now, even now, you're taking aim on our lives. Wrong! You're wrong! You're wrong! I'm telling you, Sakura would never do that! <laughs> You don't have to yell. We can hear you just fine. Don't you have an inside voice? That's terrible. It's because you're not listening to me. Wait. Please. Stop. You don't need to defend me anymore. Uh, I have to take full responsibility for this. However. How do you intend to do that? Uh, By destroying the mastermind. What? I. I'm going to challenge them. Even if it means even if it means we both go down, I will defeat them. That is how I intend to take responsibility. Huh? Hold on. What do you mean if you go down? Da if you Hina. both go down, Hina. I'm sorry I didn't tell you about this. What? I'm sorry. I didn't know what to do. I went back and forth about confiding in you again and wow. again. Rude. But I was scared. God damn it. Shut up, doggo. <laughs> Just ignore. But I was scared. I thought if I told you, you might think less of me. She's not like too loud, is she? She's like in the other room, so I'd imagine. Sakura! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sakura turned away from us and left the gym, and then... Oh shit, dude. Fucking Sakura? Are you kidding me? Sakura! <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it, it is, is officially, officially night, night time. time. Soon the doors to the dining hall will, will be locked. locked. And entry Even at that point, point is strictly, strictly prohibited. prohibited. Okay then. Sweet, Sweet dreams, dreams everyone. everyone.
Good, Good night. night. Sleep, Sleep tight. tight. And don't, don't let the bed bugs bite. bite. <laughs> God, I have like memorize that right now. <laughs> well, it's nighttime. We should all go to bed. No way! Hold on! This whole thing with Sakura is don't make me over. She's myself. our enemy. There's nothing more to discuss. That's terrible! No, Sakura is not our enemy. Why? Why? Why doesn't anyone understand her? What? What is it you think you understand? You didn't even know who she really was. What is this? That's calm down. Let it go for now, Hina. Talking about it now isn't going to help anything. Why? But anyway. Go to your room, cool down, and we can continue this discussion tomorrow. Oh, Hina. It was the worst. The mood at the end of the night was just the worst. Being in such an awful mood, we were honestly glad the day was over. Well, now Kyoko doesn't have any reason to be mad at us anymore. Because that was the thing we were going to tell her. Sakura is the spy. She's the traitor. Trouble in terrorist town. Byakuya said Sakura's the enemy. But he's wrong. She's not the enemy. She's my friend without a doubt. What can I do? What can I do to make everyone believe in Sakura? How? Oh, shit! Monica with Edith. <laughs> As long as you're human, there will always come a different point where you wish you could do things differently. Even a baseball player in the major leagues. Even a soccer player touring Europe. Even a famous singer who started her career as a backup dancer on a sketch comedy show. She makes a brilliant debut, but instead of going for more, she marries some third-rate actor and retires. Every human has regrets. Things that things they like to go back but and change. I don't, but I don't. Because I'm a bear. <laughs> oh God, I love Monokuma. But I don't, because I'm a bear. Like, <laughs> it's stupid. Good morning, everyone. Get ready to greet another beautiful day. Sakura and Leon references. Yeah, probably. I'm worried about Sakura. I need to hurry up and get to the dining hall. Well, let's go. What's up, Kyoko? Hi. One sec. Uh, um. I'm back. Ah, Makoto, are you okay? Huh, what do you mean? <laughs> you were late, so we were worried about you. <laughs> what a dullard. Tokyo? Byakuya? What are you doing here? What the heck? They're taking refuge here. That was not her voice. Refuge? <laughs> Such ignorance. Don't make that stupid face. We have to protect ourselves against the Mastermind's tool. The Mastermind's... Are you talking about Sakura? That's when I finally noticed. The only one who wasn't in the dining hall was Sakura. Huh? Where is Sakura? Stop talking. All I know, if she were here, I wouldn't be. The only reason I went on my way to join the rest of us, rest of you, is the safeguard against the threat. Threat? What is this? Why do you hate her so much? Naturally. Isn't it obvious? Because this makes things unfair. Unfair? <laughs> the game should be fair to all players. The existence of a spy in the mastermind upsets that balance. What the heck? That's a stupid reason. What? What stupid? Did you say? This is a life or death game, is it not? That's terrible! It is stupid. You're a stupid idiot. Hey. <laughs> Before you get too far in your argument, maybe you should stop and think things through. Why did the mastermind reveal that Sarko was a spy to us? What the heck? They were getting revenge on her, right? Like Monokuma said, an eye for an eye. However. That may be part of it, but it's not the whole picture. Revealing the fact that also meant Revealing the fact was also meant to serve as the next mode of the mastermind wanted to give us. The chaos and confusion born from suspicion. The hatred. In other words. In other words. That's this right here. The fighting, the bickering, is the trap the mastermind laid for us. Knowing that, will you stand there and argue like children? But... That's not what I'm trying to do, it's just... I mean, how can you, how can you guys... How can I get you guys to believe in Sakura again? <sighs> she really can't beat the mastermind like she said. That'd be a long... That'd go a long way in my what mind. Saying? Idiot! You really ask her to do something like that so dangerous? What if something terrible happens to her? <laughs> it wouldn't matter. Huh? What? If Sakura were to die, that's one less person for the mastermind to control. I have no problem with that. Hold on! Byakuya! In fact, if she did die, that would settle this entire issue, wouldn't it? It would put the whole problem to rest. Slap! <laughs> what the hell? 
Oh shit, did she slap him? You disgust me. Oh shit. You're you're a monster. To say something like that, it should have been you. You should have been the one to die. Oh my god. What? I should have died? <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Then you planning to take care of me uh, take care of that yourself? Go ahead. Try it if you dare. That's how it works here after all. What is this? Do you think I can't do it? Hina, calm down. That's right. Oh shit. Something happened again? <laughs> I didn't see it. This is exactly what the mastermind wants, and it's exactly what Sakurai doesn't want. I didn't I didn't see anything. What happened? Hmm. What's wrong? Lost your nerve? I'm leaving. I'll be in my room. Trembling with anger, Hina ran off. <laughs> right, well, I didn't even see what it was, so it doesn't matter. That stupid cow. How dare she? She, she, she should die a thousand deaths. No, a million. Shh. She was just another hysterical little girl. Hardly worth my attention. Just a second. It's what other people call having feelings, Byakuya. And all you can do is mock them for it. Hmm. What's wrong with that? Hey. A friendly word of warning. Someday that attitude's going to come back and bite you. Hard. I don't have time to And I will happily you. elude his attempts. <sighs> so, um, you know, um, how about we, uh, eat? Or maybe now it's not a good time. <laughs> Shit, dude. Without a word, each of us left the dining hall. We headed back to our rooms one by one. Just be careful with what you say. I don't I don't know what you said, but don't repeat it or anything like that. Whew. So what should I do today? <laughs> This is not the time for free time, dude. Whatever, let's just do it. Let's just go quick. I want to get this done over with. Uh, who should we hang out with today? Let's try to hang out with Kyoko? I doubt it. I doubt she'll want to, but we can try. Oh, she was. <laughs> I made a loop. Where is she? Kyoko! Kyoko! There she is. What's up, girl? Anyway. I'm busy. I don't have time to waste. Okay. You look very busy just standing there doing absolutely nothing. Uh, I was just hang out with Hina. Sure, let's hang out with Hina. I don't like her all that too much right now. Actually, can I hang out with Sakura? Wait a minute, where's Sakura? I want to hang out with Sakura. Is that possible? Sakura! I trust you! I trust you, Sakura. Where are you? Hey. I'm sorry. I'm not sure I'm ready to open up just yet. Maybe if we, maybe if you create the right opportunity. Should I hang out with Sak? <laughs> She's like, I'm not ready to open up. I'm not ready right now. And then she's like, Should I hang out with Sakura? I see. Even if I don't feel like talking, you'll still stand by me. <laughs> I still don't understand you, Makoto. Oh, I love you, Sakura. Without saying a word, I stood by Sakura. Sakura and I grew a little closer today. Yeah. What can I give her? Uh, okay, we can give her the uh. Give her the uh, rose in vitro. All I said was that Toko was just in the background made a joke instead of spoiling my brain hurts. Oh, I thought you were trying to say something about Toko. Sorry. Well, let's just change the subject. I don't know what was said, but it's probably better off that way. You know, I'm not quite sure, but somehow you reminded me of him. I'm sorry. Forget, sorry, forget I just said that. I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> anyway, I feel a little bit better now. Thank you. Aww. I love Sakura. Can I hang out with her again? I'm hanging, out, I'm hanging out with Sakura again. Sakura! Is 
Sakura! We're doing a double, double, uh, double hangout sesh with Sakura. Sakura! I'm sorry. Oh. Damn. Alright, let's hang out here then. <laughs> Listen, I'm really sorry, but God, they both want to be alone? Ah! Unfortunate. They want to be alone, but yet they're together. It's not Toko. Is she Genocide Jack? No, she's... She's Toko. I don't want to hang out with Toko. They want to be with each other. I don't want to hang out with Toko. Oh. He's like... That scared me. He like appeared. Alright. Oh, fine. I'll hang out with Toko. Hang out with Hiro or Byakuya? I'll hang out with Byakuya. He's in the warehouse. Why? Why? Oh, of course she's standing right outside where Byakuya is. Of course, of course. What's up, dude? I hate you, but what's up? <laughs> That's all. Uh, what? No, I want to talk to Bianca. Hey, we got a coin. <laughs> I want to talk to him, though. Hmm. Soccer and Hina. <laughs> Finally, some action. <laughs> Things are starting to become interesting. What do you want? Huh? I didn't see you standing there. He was just talking to himself? Did you need something? Should I talk to Bianca for a while? Sure. Why not? That's fine. Fine. I don't mind allowing you to. I don't mind allowing you to indulge in my attention. Oh my god, I have the hiccups. Nice coin. Hey. I spent some time with Byakuya. Byakuya and I grew a little closer today. He's, he's so happy looking. He's like... <laughs> <laughs> let's give him a gun. Let's let's give the man... She did click on Byakuya and I got the coin. <laughs> Can I give him this? <laughs> Wait, he likes it! <laughs> he likes the thumb! <laughs> <laughs> he likes the thumb. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Fine, I'll take it. I hope you appreciate this. <laughs> Get the impression that he liked it. So, in other words, Ima okay. So imagine, imagine the situation, right? Makoto just walks up to Byakuya, hangs out with him for a lot of a little while, and gives him like a mannequin ass with a thong on it. He's like, "Here, I think you'd like this." <laughs> just to be clear, being the ultimate affluent prodigy is one of my many talents. Some people think I rely on the care and protection of the Takami name. Huh? Is this a monologue or something? <laughs> but I don't rely, rely on my family. Rather, I am my family's savior. The, the, the Takami Corporation. Reaches across the world, true, but it will take us to even greater heights. It is expected of me, after all. Na naturally, after all, even my own family has recognized my ultimate superiority. <laughs> Goto walks in, rifles through the shelves and finds a penny, then hangs out with him and then gives him a mannequin ass with a thong on it. And then he goes on a monologue talking about he's like the prodigy of his family. In other words, even among the Togami family, I am the chosen, I am the chosen among the chosen. So much confidence. Naturally. And that confidence, is, that confidence is justified, I assure you. It comes from the battles I fought and won. Battles? I am personally worth over four billion dollars, separate from my, separate from my Torgami family assets. How the heck did you make that much money? In other words, the stock market. I buy and sell shares and assets based on market trends, all within a single day. Yes. Surely, with someone as simple-minded as you, had heard of this technique. He buys and sells stuff on the stock market. Doing, I think that's called day trading. You're talking about day trading, right? And you're able to make four billion dollars doing that? That's right. Well, I first started doing that to keep myself occupied, and before I knew it, there it was. It's not really a big deal. I'd say it's a super big deal. But wait, are the high schoolers even led by stocks and stuff? Don't make me repeat myself. I'm Byakuya Tagami. Is that meant to be an explanation? Hmm. Four billion dollars is nothing to to the Tagami Corporation, but for personal use, it's not bad. So you now understand, right? I'm not really the child of modern day nobility. You know, Byakuya, maybe we should start calling you the ultimate day trader. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't do that anymore. It was too simple, so I got bored of it pretty quickly. Jeez, you do Do you realize how insulting that sounds to the rest of us? Hmm. Of course, that's how I feel about anything I do. Frankly, life is too easy. It's only natural, natural for me to do whatever I want in this world. 
I really hope he dies. And he fucking, he, I, he deserves it, dude. Galaxies apart. Hey, we got skill points. Still reeling from Byakuya's story and went back to my room. Oh. oh boy, it's nighttime. Someone's gonna die. Good evening, every now. <coughs> okay. okay then. Good night, Monokuma. I don't ready. Tonight somehow feels uneasy. We still haven't settled things, with Sakura. Everybody's in a terrible mood. I just hope nothing happens tonight. I hope so too. And after I declined the offer and became a shrimp, the tech support lady just refused to drop the issue. Once the shrimp idea was dead, she came back suggesting that I should be a crab instead. Hold on. Why is this not updating? Oops. That is not what I wanted to happen. Wait. It's not going up. I thought I had. I thought I. I thought I would have seven uh, subscribers at this point. Maybe not. Once the shrimp idea was dead, she came back suggesting I should be a crab and said, "Wasn't it six before?" Uh, Laura, except whatever. I'm not gonna worry about it. How much can a person love crustaceans? I said no, of course, and she shot back, "Okay, then how about we make you extra special? We can make you a crab that walks back sideways and backwards. How's that any better? I don't want to go sideways or backwards. I want to go forwards." I heard her annoying sigh on the other end of the line as she said, You just don't see the splendor of a crab. Haven't you ever heard of the tale of the crab and the monkey? Of course I've heard it. I know all about it, but so what? The crab beats the monkey, but it's just some legend. Hardly relevant to a greed-obsessed modern society. Sure, monkeys will show up in movies and stuff from time to time, but not crabs. Monkey-themed clothes are sweeping the fashion world, but a crab doesn't stand a chance, right? What I'm saying is, crabs have no place in today's light-speed world. Do your market research, lady. You just muted me and won't let me in the league, you're right. Which is why you're you're always in the, you're in the league in my heart, Laura. Which is why I chose the always popular bear image. That's the secret origin story of Monokuma. Monokuma. <laughs> the emojis are so squished. I really need to change up my. Uh... 